we are, folks, the last and final boss of Half-Life. What will happen? Fuck if I know. Go watch the goddamn video.
Freeman in the flesh, or rather in the hazard suit, I took the liberty of relieving you of your weapons. Most of them were government property. As for the suit, I think you've earned it. The border world, then, is in our control for the time being, thanks to you. Quite a nasty piece of work you managed over there. I am impressed. That's why I'm here, Mr. Freeman. I have recommended your services to my uh, employers. And they have authorized me to offer you a job. They agree with me that you have limitless potential. You've proved yourself a decisive man, so I don't expect you'll have any trouble deciding what to do. If you're interested, just step into the portal and I will take that as a yes. Otherwise, well, I can offer you a battle you have no chance of winning. Rather an anticlimax after what you've just survived. Time to choose. So, this it's game has two choose. potential endings. Um, basically... You have the choice to work with the G-Man, or if you choose not to work with him, well, we'll show you what happens. Well, it looks like we won't be working together. No regrets, Mr. Freeman. Now, obviously, if you don't work with him, the ending sucks, so this is what happens if you do choose to work with him. Wisely done, Mr. Freeman. I will see you up ahead. Well, folks, there you have it. That is Half-Life 1. Freeman successfully escapes from the Black Mesa compound. You may have noticed that guy with the blue suit throughout the series. That is the G-Man. We don't know what his particular role is. Um, you now become his employer. As you may have observed from the uh, previous episodes, the G-Man pretty much has been keeping an eye on you, and basically you're his puppet, more or less. Uh, if you've been looking at the, what do you call, uh, that, if you look at that Half-Life Saga timeline story thingy, uh, it 
kind of has a guess as to what exactly who the G-Man is and what his role is in the whole story arc. It's a pretty interesting read. I'd heavily recommend you guys uh, check it out if you haven't already.